Welcome back to Curiosity. No more mud. No more uh, spiders, I think. And now we go to a new floor that I've never seen before. The chasm. Bithro found himself in a large underground chasm that contained a large pit in the centre. The dome shape of the cavern twisted the wind into a violent swirl, making the rickety bridges and floating platforms used to traverse it particularly unsafe. You'd have to be crazy to use those things, and even crazier to build them in the first place, Bithro thought to himself as he gazed down the large pit. That's a long way to fall. I better watch my step. So let's see what Masm... Masm? Chasm? Mad... Madnism... Madness! I can't think of the word. Madness is now um, created. Day 27. I'm going to ask the goblins if they know anything. They've always been very friendly if I take a large selection of fruits with me. It's a rare treat for those underground creatures. It's a shame to walk... It, or it's a shame the walk is so long. It'd be much quicker if I could just... If I could cross over the chasm. I once asked one of the goblins if they knew a way past the strong currents that make it possible to traverse the cavern. And he told me the king could point the way. But when I asked the goblin king, he just laughed at me. Goblins can be unhelpful sometimes. Yes, they can. Okay, so don't close it. I'm going to close this door. Okay, there we go. Um, so by the looks of things, I need to kill... This snake quick enough, which means I need him to be looking a different way. And I need to go this way and trap Dorim. Alright. Next, we see we need to go across this. And we can knock off those rocks. I don't think there's a reason we need them. I don't know if we want to walk across there or here. It's going to be here. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. It's not going to be there. It's going to be this way. So we do got to go this way first. Um, Is there another trap door somewhere that I missed? Apparently there is. Where's the other trap door that I'm missing? I don't see that door closing. Oh, the, uh, the trap door on the bomb. Okay. Okay, so I'm guessing I just gotta kill this goblin. So I'm assuming this bomb will destroy all those rocks. Yep. Then we got it to blow up. Oh, nope, I missed that rock. I don't. Uh, I missed that rock. I can't believe it. Okay. Um. There we go. Now we can get through. And we just got those goblins left, which are unhelpful goblins, according to the, the, um, the, the, whatchamacallit, the scroll. But we can just kill them using this nice little, uh, pit contraption right here. There we go. I like that. So going left or right. I will choose right. Right's always the right direction. And it seems like we got more golems to kill. More. And this is messing with my mind. Okay, so we need this goblin to get through here. I mean, we need that to be covered up, but... The only issue is, once covered up, you cannot get anything off it. What happens if I do that? It seems like I gotta do something in there too. Possibly get a golem in there? This is messing with my mind again. <laughs> I 
The other question is how am I gonna get- okay, well... It seems like some things I can do is something like this. If there was a way I could actually have the golem walk across this, I'd be pretty good. But alas, I don't think there's anything I can actually do to get him to walk across. I mean, I could do something like this, but... That's not really helping. This is actually kind of confusing me. What if I actually juggled these? Juggle them like so. So if I could actually have that bigger platform, I could get that giant rock golem on the... Yeah, there we go. And then I can actually move off. There we go. I just have to sacrifice that single platform. Alright, now we got a double platform. And with this double platform, we can get rid of that other rock golem. I think that's because we can have him. Maybe do something? I actually do not know what we can do with him. Um, there we go. Now we can go ahead and... I don't know if we want the big platform again or if it does really matter. Just for... Just for safety, I'm going to... That. Alright, now we got that trap door open. Except I actually want to be able to access this platform. Like that. Okay, so if, obviously if this is hit, I can't get out. I need to get some sort of goblin in- not goblin, rock one. And what I can do... is something like this. Now we can get him in there. And we can utilize... This. I do need the rock him a little more to the... Right, though. Now the last question is, how do I keep this closed? Now that I think about it... May have been best to keep that guy there. Just so he can get out. Then we go ahead and get this guy through. There we go. Now when we go in, in there... He lets us through. Oh, the only problem is he closes that off, and we do not want him to close it off. So we're gonna have to keep him in there somehow. Oh, I didn't use that checkpoint. Oh, no! I didn't use one checkpoint? Oops. No! I. This is why I'm scared to do checkpoints, so I like unlimited undo. I sometimes do that. I'm like. 
I think I used every checkpoint, and then it turns out I didn't. Uh... Oh well, we'll just do it again. Not much else I can do about it. But at least we kind of have a general idea of what we're doing, so it's a lot quicker. Okay. Okay. I wonder... I wonder, wonder, wonder. What if I did something like this? I think I need this to actually be higher up than I was thinking. Or maybe more like yeah. this. So my idea is what if I actually utilize these guys more right here. Now I can actually bring this rock golem over here. And he's going to be nice enough to stay there, at least I think. There we go. Oh, that works a lot better than what I did earlier. <laughs> Alright, that golem is going to come for us if I... So I want one golem there. And I want one golem here. This one doesn't matter as much. I don't think this guy really matters. And then that guy, yeah, that works, I think. There we go, room clear. Definitely quite a room, I have to say. And then we got this room. Okay, you can walk across this. I don't know how that helps. Alright, so we have to hit that switch fast. Then we have to guide the snake through a maze? It seems like it. That doesn't seem like too hard of a maze though. Unless I need them both on this switch? Yeah, I'm gonna need them both on that switch. Okay. So not only do I have to get them all through, I have to even, um... Get them to... Not go a certain way. And he's gonna be stubborn enough. Okay, that one will go hit the switch for us, so that he's okay. I think I don't think we have to really worry about too much about um the current pathway. I think I'll be able to fit, finish it later. Maybe. Maybe I want to be going this way. The only problem is, I think I want to keep them in there, actually, for now, until I work out a path. It'll be easier to work out a path if he's not running around with us. Maybe something like that. Maybe. Maybe. 
Okay, there we go. Now, lastly, we just have to get every trap door. I don't think that's going to be too di uh, too difficult. Maybe it'll serve to be difficult. Possibly. Yeah, it might, it might actually serve to be difficult. Um, no, it won't. No, it won't. No, it won't. It's okay. It's okay. All right, so that room's clear. That's an interesting room, actually. All right, let's go down. Onwards! Uh... I like this one. <laughs> uh... <laughs> what goes on in um his head I will never understand. Uh I'm pretty sure this is a good direction. I think this will kind of help. There we go. That helps a little bit. But now I need to, I have the problem of actually... Yeah, of actually getting those guys out. If I had more room, I don't have enough room. That's a problem. Only I had more room. All right, so I'm obviously gonna have to redo this. We need to do kind of what I did with earlier, but do it where I have more room. That's my that's my goal. There we go, now I have a lot more room. Okay, I can work with this. That, that really helped. Uh, I, I think I need these guys to go in here though still. Um, the only problem is now I need to these guys are not working with me. Maybe I can... Yeah, I think this actually would work a lot better than what I was trying to do. Whatever that was. If I can get these guys to pile up, kind of like that. Now it's a lot easier. A lot easier. Much easier. So much easier. Okay, there we go. Huh, that was a... Quite a tricky room. Really tricky room. I like it. Well done. I really like that one. I want to go to the next one now. Where am I? Goblins. Golems. A lot of stuff. And snakes. Too much to handle. Is there a way I can kill these snakes or... Is there a way where I can have one goblin with me? Yeah, there is. There is. There is. There is. Until that other one decides to sneak over. No! Go away, other goblin! Shoo! Okay. No, it's okay. Okay, there we can get him in there. 
and then we can go ahead and kill this one. I don't know if I need, um... Oh, I might need a rock column in one of those, actually. I'm gonna need a rock column in one of those. I'm gonna need a rock column in both of those. Oh, I can't kill the rock columns. I was thinking that I didn't need the rock columns, but actually the, the rock columns are gonna be what kills those guys. But then how do I stop these rock columns? Oh, I guess I gotta do something like that. Alright, so these goblins I do not want. These goblins are unimportant, as far as I can tell. They don't serve any purpose other than to mess with you. So we can go ahead and sneak him out. Might as well get one of these guys in here, if we can help it. So we can go ahead and get him in there. The only problem is, once he's in there, I how do I kill him? I really can't kill him. Sure I can. Right there. Alright. Where's the other goblin? Just so I can get rid of him. Now we go to the parade number two. Parade number two. Let's go for it. Alright. Then this golem is going to be a little trickier to get. Just a little bit. He's not going to be tricky to get at all. That goblin. Okay, this one... We're, no, this one's not going to be really that much trickier. Okay, he's going to be fine. Oh, but I cannot... Um, I cannot... Uh, how do I get him... Oh, I need to use... Oh. Uh, so actually, I set this up incorrectly. I need to be over here. We have to. Add, oh, I see. I just. I just saw the platform. Okay. All right. Now we can utilize this to get the goblin or the goblin, the golem in there. And then we can have the golem go. I cannot have him go there. Oh no, I can. Okay, so I sneak through, and room clear. I have no idea how many minutes I'm running on. So, we've gone through, what, five rooms? This Nuntar silently stalks me. No. <laughs> so, uh, next time on Let's Play Curiosity, we'll continue exploring this chasm. See you boys and girls then. Goodbye.